what has in recent election cycle also determined the place of minimum, minimal irregularities in an election, uh, which we did in the matter of Gideon Chekonchela and Julius uh, Sunkuli. We are satisfied that the Superior Court correctly analyzed the effect of illegalities and irregularities on the election and cannot fault their finding that they were not of such magnitude as to justify the invalidation of disputed elections. We are of the view that the will of the, pe the, will of the people of Changame constituency was duly expressed and in keeping with our pronouncements in the above outlined cases of Munya, Raila 2013, Raila 2017 cases, while they may have been in fact imperfect in the conduct of elections, they did not impeach or affect the overall outcome of results. The appellant has challenged the Court of Appeals determination on costs, arguing that the appeal was a public interest litigation and it should not attract costs. Conversely, the respondents affirm the Court of Appeals determination at costs that costs follow the event. The law on costs is set out on Section 84 of the Elections Act, and we have laid down the law as we find it, and a number of cases in which we have made our decision on the issue of costs, and we see no reason to fault the reasoning of the learned appellate judges on costs. The appellant has not, discriminate, has not demonstrated how in reaching their determination the learned judges applied wrong principles or that they exercised discretion capriciously or whimsically. We are satisfied that the Court of Appeal appreciated the principles enunciated in the above case and arrived at the correct decision. The costs so awarded were neither punitive or excessive. Consequently, we shall not interfere with that determination. It is in this light we hold that the appellant shall bear the costs of this appeal. Consequent upon our findings above, the final orders in this matter are the following. One, that the judgment of the Court of Appeal of Kenya sitting in Mombasa, dated 26 July 2018, is upheld. That the petition of appeal number 31 of 2018, dated 3rd September 2018, is hereby dismissed. For the avoidance of doubt, the declaration of the result of the election by the IEBC in respect of the member of National Assembly for Changamwe constituency is affirmed. And lastly, the appellant shall bear the cost of this appeal. That is the decision of the court. Much obliged. It proceeds with the ruling of petition number six of 2016. All right, that was Justice Njokin Dungu giving a ruling or when it comes to the Changame parliamentary seat where Omar Muni's election has also been upheld. Earlier on, the, the court also upheld the election of Lamu governor. Now, away from the corridors of justice, I'd like us to shift our focus to matters education.